Welcome to Vlogmas Day 9. Today I wanted to formally introduce you to my beauty room slash office. Now, I know what you're thinking. Wasn't this Luna's room? And then before that it was a makeup room and then it was a storage room. So what is happening? I don't really know what's going on, but this is our plan for right now and we're rolling with it. My skin is very angry with me today. So no makeup for me. We are going to turn this room into my makeup room slash office once again and let me explain. In case you missed our house update, basically we're planning on staying here till the end of our lease. Then we are going to move in with my parents for a couple of months while we wait for our house to be ready to be bought. I know that doesn't make any sense, but we're buying a house from a family member. They bought a different house and they're currently renovating that house. And until the renovations are far enough along, we have to wait to buy the house that we're going to buy. So uh, <laughs> this it's been delayed. This was supposed to happen this past summer and it's just uh, out of our control. So <laughs> that's our current plan. We're just kind of going with the flow and since we have the space already cleared out, uh, we thought we might as well kind of make the most of our time here the last like three months that we have here and turn this back into an office for me. Since Luna still sleeps in our room, she sleeps in her crib in our bedroom. So she doesn't even use this as a bedroom. She never really did use this as a bedroom other than like we would bring her in here to change her diaper and get her dressed. But now we just have her dresser in our bedroom. So that's our situation. I know it's not like the most traditional or like maybe even like functional. I don't know, but this is just what's working for us. So that's our plan. <laughs> Sorry if you can hear Luna in the other room. So anyway, I've got my Coke Zero here and we're gonna, we're gonna get to it. So if you're new, don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy and let's go ahead and get started. Just to give you an idea of what we're working with, this is what the room currently looks like. You can tell Luna got into my empties over there. Um, so we have a few things in here still. We actually just got a storage unit, which is how we were able to empty out everything else that was in here. So we're moving everything over to our storage unit slowly but surely. Actually, honestly, not even really that slowly. We're kind of like cranking through it. But anyway, here's my plan for this room. I think I kind of want my filming background for like sit down videos to be this corner. I've never had a corner as a background, but I think that's what I want to do. I know it sounds crazy, but I want to get a curtain for in here, like a sheer white curtain just to kind of dress it up a little bit and make it look a little nicer and not just like having blinds in the background. So I am thinking I want an angled situation, which means these units here, I'm gonna, oh my, what is happening? My plan is to line them up across this wall, have my makeup vanity, which is currently here, and have it at an angle so that, like I said, if my camera was on a tripod, this is kind of the background situation. Then we have my computer, which is actually in Jarvis's office. Both of our computers are currently in there. So I'm gonna move it back over here so that when we're playing, video games or whatever. We don't have to like hear each other in the microphone and other people don't have to hear us twice. So my computer is either going to go here or over here, which is where it used to be. It kind of just depends. We have some PR packages over here that I'm saving up for a PR unboxing later during Vlogmas. And then this chair is from Luna's room. So it'll probably end up getting put in the storage unit shortly. So that's the rundown. These bookshelves, I'm guessing, are going to go in the storage unit or at least out in the garage for now because all of my books are already packed up. So we'll have to take care of the stuff on the shelves. But I just wanted to get a start on this room today. I do have my body care in here and skin care that I had packed up because when I originally packed this stuff up, I packed it up with the intention that we would be unboxing these things in a couple of months, like max two, three months. But that was like four or five months ago at this point, and we still have a few months until we're in the new house. So um, we're gonna unbox these, probably do some organizing in my Alex 9 drawer units. This one is currently empty. 
and we'll go from there. So I think the first step to this is gonna be to move these units over to the wall where I think I'm gonna want them. I'm gonna put like some decorative stuff on top so that it's like a cute background, but it's not just gonna be like a flat wall with like stuff on a table behind me because back in the day, if you remember my filming background, I used to have like uh, something from Ikea and I had stuff sitting on top of it behind me. I don't have that table anymore. We sold like a bunch of our Ikea stuff like several months ago. No, it was like a year ago. It was before Luna was born because we were making space for her. So I'm gonna move these. They're super heavy. This one has all of my makeup in it. This one has nothing in it. And this one has like some makeup brushes and random stuff in it. So I'm gonna move all three of these over there. Okay, we've got one down and two to go. This is the one that has my makeup in it. And now that I'm looking at this, I feel like this like juts out farther than I thought it was going to. So we'll have to see what we can do here as far as a background goes. So I moved them over here and being in the room, this doesn't really make sense having them where they're at because it kind of blocks the window. But I think when I am filming, it will make sense. I'm hoping, if not, I can always just like redo this. But here is what they look like over here. There's something behind this drawer, so I'm gonna have to like unscrew it and get whatever is behind it so that the drawer shuts properly. But so far, so good. We cleared out this spot over here so we'll be able to get these out into the garage which will be nice um but so far so good i think i might like rearrange them because this one they're not like lining up properly like these two are okay but then this one is like way off <laughs> so um i have to figure out why that's happening but i might just like move this one to where this one is and this one over there just so that the ones in the background are at least like flush together. So that's what I'm gonna do now. So I pulled my desk over here just to kind of see what it would look like and I even grabbed my other camera just so I could see like what the background like roughly is gonna look like so obviously again in person this doesn't make sense like it <laughs> it looks a little odd but I, I think I like it I do want to get a curtain for this window and I know like putting up a curtain just for a couple months seems kind of silly but I just I feel like it's gonna look really good I'm hoping that it does at least and there's already holes in the wall so it's not like you know it is what it is <laughs> we're gonna have to fix it no matter what but um, I think this is working out well. Now, as far as my gaming setup, like my computer, I could have it here or I could have it over here. I think I'm gonna do it over here because with like my tripod and everything here, this just feels a little bit crowded. So I think the gaming setup is gonna go over here, which is where it used to be. Everything is on the floor right now. So it's kind of a mess in here, but Here's just kind of like what things are looking like at the moment. So I think I might try to get this chair out of here. So I'm gonna stack up my packages over here next to my Alex nine drawer units. And then we will go from there. Thank you. 
So now I have my PR packages over there and then I have these ones from Sol de Janeiro, which in Vlogmas day five, I think, I did a Sol de Janeiro organization vlog. So if you wanna see me organize my Sol de Janeiro collection in my bathroom, go check that video out. Like I said, I think it was Vlogmas day five. Um, so these I'm gonna put away, but so far so good. This is a bunch of makeup that I've decluttered. Well, this is an empty, so I'm I'm filming an empties video for Vlogmas as well. <laughs> um, but this is a bunch of makeup that I have decluttered. So I need to go through this makeup and figure out what is like giveawayable and what I need to throw away, like what's like old and gross and needs to be tossed. So that has to be gone through. Um, I think I'm gonna start by cleaning this off next and then putting like my little organizers back onto here just so we have like a semi-functional setup again. And then I'm definitely gonna need Jarvis's help with like the rest of that stuff. I'm here with another little check-in. So this is the setup that I used to have like as far as the vanity goes, like these organizers were all here. So this is kind of like how things used to be. Um, so I just kind of put it back how it was like a few years ago when I had a dedicated beauty room. Um, obviously this isn't gonna stay like this cause there's like things piled on top of each other, but this is kind of what we're working with as of now. And I think I like it for now, but I definitely, We'll need to adjust this in the future. I don't have a chair for in here because the one I had, I had for like eight years and it was disgusting and like matted faux fur. And so we got rid of it, but I need a little like rolly chair. So my everyday makeup drawers are currently in here. I have some makeup that I need to like put away. So we're gonna do that in a second, but this is kind of just what I threw together as far as like a background goes. Um, so yeah, that's kind of what we're working with at the moment and I'm liking how things are going. I need to figure out how I'm gonna organize these drawers. I have my, um, I think this is my body care box. I'm not 100% sure, I'm hoping it is because otherwise it's in the storage unit somewhere. And then I have, this box over here, which is skincare. So let's go ahead and put this makeup away. This is like makeup that I have used in the last couple of days, um, probably the last like week and a half, honestly. And it, I think it's all from my everyday makeup drawers. So let's put this stuff away. So things are looking good over here. We can kind of see like how the background will be. I'll be a little bit lower than this, like maybe more like here, but I'll have like a pretty curtain behind me, which I think is gonna look really good. Um, I still have to figure out how I'm gonna organize these. So this one has some stuff in it. Um, I think in like the top like five drawers, it is like beauty related, like my brush cleaner stuff is in this drawer. I have like washcloths and like cotton pads in this drawer. Um, I think I have like sponges and brushes and things down here. Um, I think there's like makeup bags in here, which is now not closing properly. So we'll have to take care of that. And then this one is completely empty. Um, so I am going to use one of these for like skincare and body care. So I think I'm going to open up these boxes and see what's in them to see what exactly we have to organize. All right. So let's see what we've got in here. I just have these like little scissors to use to open this up. Hopefully this one is skincare. I'm pretty sure I know what's in this box. Um, oh wait, this looks like body care. Interesting. Okay, so this is actually my body care box. So I'm thinking the one that says bathroom is skincare. So let's open that up and hopefully there's skincare in here. Okay, so I think this is my skincare and hair care. So 
this is good this is what i was hoping to find in here another quick update on what i'm calling an organized mess the floor is now clear which is fantastic um i have some boxes of stuff here which looks like a mess but it's like kind of organized i have my perfumes here decluttered makeup here my empties here and then in that box in this box we just have some miscellaneous stuff the bookshelves here are not organized at all it's pretty random we have a lot of our legos on here like our pre-built legos along with some other random stuff so we'll have to organize those and like figure out a way to pack up legos i think jarvis said that he looked it up and he basically like some ran wrap them or bubble wrap them or something so we'll have to do that soon but i'm happy with the progress that i've made today i think this is looking really cute and my computer desk will be going here but i'm gonna need jarvis's help for that and it's already pretty late so this chair will be leaving this room um this is like i said from her nursery and um it's like a glider we love this thing we've used it quite a bit and since luna doesn't really have a room right now we haven't been using it recently it's kind of just been like chilling in here so we will be putting this into the storage unit i think this should fit in our car i think the back of it comes off like this piece like slides in and out and then it should definitely fit in our car so that we can just move it to the storage unit and probably like cover it i'll probably have to get like a dust bag or something but this will be out of here this is all cleared it's just like this corner over here that needs some work and then over here we have these boxes so we have like mostly skincare in here and then this is all body care i think hair care might be in here too um so this is all stuff that's gonna go into these drawers, so I'm gonna do that now, and then I think I'll probably call it a night. I think I'm gonna start down here with the body care, so I'm gonna slide this box out of the way, and we'll get down here and organize this body care. Okay, wow, it's been so long <laughs> since I've had my skincare and stuff organized into drawers, so um i don't even know what to put where let's do let's do kopari in this drawer i guess so this is all of my kopari body care i know you can't really see it let me see if i can get a better angle Hopefully this is a little better. <laughs> I know it's still not the best. So Kopari is gonna go in here. So I'm just gonna organize this. Okay, so we have the Kopari stuff in this drawer, which is good to go. Now I'm gonna move on to this bottom drawer here and I have like some first aid beauty stuff here and some other miscellaneous stuff. Um, I'm also, I also have a quite a bit of loxiton, so maybe we'll do, you know, maybe we'll go up a drawer actually. I'll do first aid beauty and loxiton in this drawer and then the bottom one will be like miscellaneous stuff so this is my loxiton and first aid beauty stuff the rest of my skincare is kind of miscellaneous it's like uh bath and body works trader joe's lush um i literally just like read things there's like laura mercier stuff in here so i'm gonna organize this drawer oh forgot about this and then we'll put the rest of this in the bottom drawer
Okay, so this drawer is done. And now we're gonna work on this last body care drawer. It's crazy because I used to have so much body care that I filled up an entire one of these Alex 9 drawer units, which just blows my mind. Actually, I think it was hair care and body care, but still, I had so, so much stuff. So this last drawer has the rest of my body care in it. So this is nice and organized. I feel so good about this. I used to have a whole drawer dedicated to Bath & Body Works. I only have three Bath & Body Works products now. I used to have a whole drawer dedicated to Lush. I used to have multiple Lush drawers. I had one for like body washes and products and like the tubs of stuff and then one dedicated to just bath bombs. And then I just, I had so much body care. So I've really downsized quite a bit. So. This feels good, this looks good, and we have an empty box. So now we just have some skincare, so I'm gonna crank through that and I'll kind of show you the finished product. So here is what my skincare and body care unit is looking like. Skincare, hair care, and body care. So first up, we have this top drawer, which has cleansing balms, cleansers, makeup removers. Then we have this drawer, which has sprays, toners, and masks that like, these are like radiance pads, but kind of like toners. Then we have this drawer, which has serum, sunscreens, treatments, and moisturizers. These drawers are obviously not like the most, oh my God, this just fell. <laughs> that scared me. <laughs> these are obviously not the most aesthetically pleasing drawers, but they work for what I need them to, at least for right now. I just kind of like quickly did this. Then we have our first hair care drawer, which has some Pacifica and Olaplex products. Then we have this drawer, which has some other miscellaneous brands like Way, Biosilk, Day, IGK. Then we have this drawer, which is a true miscellaneous drawer. This is obviously the ugliest drawer. We have like nail polish, makeup remover pads, uh, combs, hair clips, random things like that. Just kind of tossed in there. And then you guys saw these drawers. We have the First Aid Beauty and Loxaton drawer. Then we have the Kopari drawer. And then finally we have our other like miscellaneous body care drawer, which has some other brands. So that's gonna be it for this Vlogmas video. I hope you enjoyed the like organization slash like setting up my beauty room again video. I'm so excited to get back into filming. I'm excited to have like my desk in here again and hopefully be able to play some games and maybe even do some gaming streams. I've been wanting to get back into that for so long. It's just been so hard. Like obviously Luna is our priority and we've figured out a way to where we can like play games while she naps or like she plays in the room with us <laughs> while we're playing games and things. So it's been a balance and I'd like to kind of start off with some like smaller streams, like shorter streams while um, Jarvis can watch Luna for me and maybe we can do um, like a Stardew Valley series. I've been loving Stardew Valley. It's, I'm like obsessed with it again. I've been obsessed with it and I really want to do like a perfection run and try to get perfection and I'd love to like stream the whole thing. So I have a gaming channel, it's Pagecorn Gaming. I'll have it linked down below in case you're interested in that. I'm not sure when that will happen, but hopefully soon, we'll see. Um, I miss my community over there. We literally, it was so good. I loved streaming. <laughs> so hopefully we can get back into a little bit of that, but for now we will just kind of make our way and progress towards that. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please don't forget to subscribe and give it a thumbs up. I love you so, so much. I hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.